Hello and welcome. I have here for you a uh, new vehicle, or so it says, uh, from Knaus. It is the Van Wave 640M Meg, sorry, 92,000 euros nearly. There you, there you go. I get the technical stuff up as well for you if it comes up. And there you go, seven meter long van, 699, 220 wide, and it's a standing height inside 196. Um, so, uh, coming inside, you'll notice, might have noticed the shape of the bump in the roof. That When you see a bump in the roof, that means to say there's gonna be a drop down bed. Uh, large table, that's something quite nice, as well as a space to sit your legs under the table if you can actually see that from here um right this here at the back uh, has got a large ish german layout at the back there are windows at both sides storage at the back including on uh, there's a ledge there uh with a place for discharge your phone so there's a usb point there as well as 230 volts uh point uh, i've got a completely pointless thing up here uh, what's why is that there it's because people who design these vehicles never actually use them so if they use them then they would know um, you, you sometimes see these things here and this, this is a good example they've got uh, this has been prepared for something to some electrical device to actually uh, come through there um, it, the bed is over two meters one feature is here just come up like that Get, it gives you access to the wardrobe which is i think also rather positive and you've got the same thing on this side as well so this has been used for storing boxes uh, it comes with a sensible sliding door and there's a light somewhere so let's see if i can turn the light on there's here's the light switches are the lights on oops i think no they're not Go back, try again, where's the washroom? That's the bedroom, that's the dinette, that's the outside. And okay, right, don't know where the washroom light is. How embarrassing. Anyway, never mind, you, you, get, a, you get a picture. Now here, the this uh, has got a sliding, this door comes in and out like that. And you know, that gives you a bit of space there. And... That goes back. Uh, you wouldn't, of course, have a carpet down there normally, but this is for the trade event here. Protect the floor, and I'll show you the thing under it. Two uh, plug holes at either side of the uh, tray. That's very good. It also comes with a sensible sliding door. Here we've got a 150 litre tower fridge. I'll put the lights on. I'll turn them off now. That's the bedroom light. There's the kitchen light. Still haven't found the. See, and we've got there, yeah, the 12 volts being turned on. See, 12 volts turned on, lights are turned on. Anyway, good. So uh, we'll have a look at this. Two burners. I think two burners are okay. Uh, sink we've got it says here that they're stable and they have a soft close and um, they've got very good hinges on these things um, uh, right this has a large seating group I mean certainly this this table is brilliant I mean, uh, for those that want a large table I mean I know everybody doesn't want a large table I want a large table this vehicle is based on the Volkswagen uh, chassis and uh, right now what I don't like about other than being Knaus which I don't like at all but they've uh, got this step up here and uh, you know I'd like, I'd like to see a double floor flat floor all the way to the back and I think at this price range well okay I do accept it's on a VW which is a uh, expensive uh, chassis to build on but I think it could be given uh, as well uh, right let's have uh, walk out uh, as you come in also because I actually I, I knelt over onto the bed that wasn't necessary you can turn the lights off here as well as you can see there you go put them back on again uh, kitchen extension here 
Uh, what you can do, of course, with any van is you just, when you go out, you turn off the this, the 12 volt, and the lights go off. There is that light there is from outside. That's for the show. So, uh, good. Uh, the will come on eventually, I think. I think. Oh, wait, I'll put them back on. In the door, there's an integrated flat, uh, mosquito net. Uh, unfortunately, the door. Oh, it does have three. No, it's only got one point, so. Uh, only one point again, I think I'd expect two. I can see that the door's been prepared for three, uh, but that, that's obviously the door manufacturer who did that. Also, I, I, I think if the door's not being used for anything else, uh, and it's a new door, I'd like to have a window in there as well. Anyway, that's me. Right, let's have a look here. So right here we've got, there you've got your, your gas cupboard to take only one gas cylinder. So you're not gonna stay long uh, if you, in cold weather with that fantastic garage very nice very good garage in here and uh, let's come around to the to the side all right fuse box there this thing here though I really I personally I want this inside you know when the, something happens I, I like to be able to just flick the switch it happened to me here and it was uh, it was snowing outside and it was minus eight or something and I don't I wouldn't want to go out get dressed go out just to flick the switch only for it to go down, back down again I like this inside the vehicle somewhere that's just me others may think uh, differently um, that it, the, with a Oh, it's, a, it's a lithium battery, life pole 4, 80 ampere hours. Even 80 ampere hours life pole 4 is better than two uh, traditional batteries at 80 ampere hours. Um, 80 doesn't sound like much, but I suppose if you're not using it all that great, it might, it might, be, it might be enough. Uh, right, so we've got a service box here. Uh, so, uh, and here we've got... The uh, because you fill it up with the water, I've uh, got your Truma uh, frost control there, and you can see the heating system there. And here, if you need to actually dump your water, you do it uh, from there. And that's for the sewage cassette, and that's for the exhaust for the boiler. All right, bring the thing around here. It's got uh, air, com uh, what do you call it? air suspension uh, as well. Right, good. So, thanks very much for watching. Hope you found that interesting. And uh, I uh, upload uh, every day at 21.15 in my time. I'm in Europe. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm in Germany <laughs> and in Poland. That's where I spend most of my time. So I'm in other places as well. Uh, so, for the moment, all the best for me. Bye for now.